Hi there, it's Oliver here at Data Bowl. Today I'm going to go over why we have the date of birth format in the ISO 8601 format. Um, date of births can be in various different formats all over the globe and as we operate globally we have to find a way to standardize and harmonize the formats to make sure that we can connect and communicate with other systems. There are a few other additional benefits. We can compute things such as age, we can separate out the date of birth, day, month and year uh, and also that allows you to create rules and conditions around the age allowing you to filter out certain um, ages that you don't want as records. So if we take a look on Wikipedia here we can see the usage by country um, there's all sorts of different formats. If you look here globally very much different ways of um, capturing date of birth and there are a myriad of different formats that you can use. So what we do is we standardize the data in the ISO format and when it comes to outputting the data we have a reformatter and this basically allows you to select a range of different options here uh, which covers all the bases to make sure that the data is output into the uh, CRM system in the correct format. Just because your clients in the UK doesn't necessarily mean the date of birth format is going to follow the UK date of birth format. They may have an American CRM system. So again, ensuring that you have the ability to reformat and we have a standardized approach allows you to integrate with all sorts of different remote systems. Uh, hopefully that's helpful and um, stay tuned for more tips.